Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we'll see how to drill down in Excel. When you have a large amount of data, you may want to split it into groups to make it more manageable. For example, if you have a worksheet like I do in this example that has subtotals, you may want to then group this data and by collapsing the rows so that you can then have only the subtotals displayed and drill down into more details when required. So there are two ways of doing this. The first is to select the rows that you want grouped or collapsed. On the data menu, go to outline and under group, select group. Now here I want to group rows, so I'll say OK. Now you can see that a line has appeared to the left with a minus sign at the end. And if I click this, the rows get collapsed. Now, when I want to drill down, I just need to click this and the section expands and I can see more details of the rows. Now, this can be repeated for subsequent uh, sections and then you will be able to collapse all the sections, see only the subtotals and then drill down to the details. So this is one way of doing it. I'm just going to press Ctrl Z to undo this change and let's look at the other way. For that, I'll select the sheet, then under the same outline, instead of selecting group, I will say auto outline. So when uh, I select this, you can see that Excel has automatically dete detected the sections and grouped them accordingly. Now this is possible only if you have uh, properly discernible sections, like in this case I have subtotal rows. If you just have a set of data, this uh, feature may not work correctly. I can now click the level I want, which is 1. So 1 means that uh, the rows are grouped and I have only the subtotals displayed. I can then drill down accordingly to whichever section I want to examine in more detail. This is how to drill down in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance. 